come before us. Hey everybody, welcome to the Way the White Guy Show. I'm Marty, this is Cracker, and we're going to do a very brief story time. I was up in Wisconsin recently in La Crosse, Wisconsin, if you've ever been. Uh, to have some drinks from, with some friends from college. I went to UWLs. And uh, <laughs> when I was there, I was there from 04 to 2012, and I started drinking in that time, and I found a beer called Murphy's, which I can't find. Did I tell you this? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Oh, fuck you. Uh, I can't fucking find this Murphy's anywhere. I've been to Colorado. It's like that Johnny Cash song. I've been to Tulsa, but they've been, I've been everywhere. Be I've been never. Couldn't find Murphy's anywhere. So I get up there and I know it's there. But I, like, I would find Murphy's whilst drunk. And I'd be like, you got Murphy's? I'd be like, oh, we sure do. And so I, and I'd be like, yeah. And then I couldn't remember where the fuck I, I, I drank it. <laughs> I didn't know who had it. So I'm with my friend Potsy. And we're going from place to place to place. And I'd be like, and we're both, we, we're, you know, getting drunk, so we're both doing Irish accents. And I'm like, so you got some Murphy's here? They're like, no, we don't, what, what's Murphy's? Ah, oh, it's Murphy's, it's a tiny little beer. It's about this big, it says Murphy's on it, and if you drink it, oh, it's glorious. It's like drinking vagina, straight out of the glass. Oh, it's just wonderful. And, um, nobody has it. So we go to bar to bar to bar, and then we go, we're in this one bar, and a dude comes in, and says, it. His girlfriend's upset. It's like, I've seen this before. He's like, there's only six or eight of us in the bar. And he's like, I had shots for everybody. And so we, we're getting shots. We're getting incrementally more drunk. And we're going more Irish as we're getting drunker in our, and being Irish in this. And everywhere I'm going, I'm like, you got more. So finally, we're getting right about bar time. We've got about 20, 30 minutes left, maybe. Okay. And we go to this place. I don't know. Oh, oh Irish in this. Is, and it's actually the place with the fucking shamrock on the thing. And what was funny is we were walking down the street, the drunker we're getting, we're losing the Irish and we're going to Scottish. And we can't, we're, now, we're, we're like, now we're like full on drunk. And we, we're, we can't, I'm like, no, that's Scottish, that's Braveheart. And Paz is like, you know, to something Scottish, but I can't do it. But it's like, no, it's got to be Irish. And then I try to do it, I'm like, fuck, I lost my Irish. No, I'm Scottish? I can't get it back. So we walk into the place, and after like 20 bars, here's the thing about La Crosse, Wisconsin, if you've never been, if you ever need to do some drinking, that's the place to go. They had the record for years, most bars and pubs per square mile anywhere in the world. Okay. Now they're number two, you fags. <laughs> so, <laughs> you so, so I know, you so lose. So they, um, it's a great, like most places you go to, a, like around here, mm -hmm. around the country, you go to a bar. You don't want to drive, so maybe go to one more before you're drunk, and then you wait all the stuff going. Here you can just go bar to 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 bar Get a drink at everyone. Just get hammered and plowed. It's like 15 bars to choose from, all in walking distance. So, again, I don't remember the point of that, but by the time we get there, we're fucking, we're drunk, and we're running out of time. And I walk in there, and I sit down, and I look up, and I see some blue moon. I'm like, oh, I'll take a blue moon. And then Potts is like, what about the moon? And I'm like, oh, fuck! <laughs> and she's handing me... <laughs> and she's handing me the blue motor. I'm like, can I, can I... Do you have Murphy's? She's like, yeah. He's like, can I get that instead? He's like... And I'm like, all right, all right. So she, <laughs> she gets a blue moon. Uh -huh. I got a blue moon. Tall glass. Yeah. And a Murphy's. And then she's... We got like 10 minutes. Oh, wow. <laughs> It's like, I gotta pee. I'm like... <laughs> and then she comes back around the corner and she gets a few sips of blue moon. I got the Murphy's down in some of the blue moon. And then I look up and there's nobody there and the guy's like, get the fuck out of our bar! <laughs> <laughs> so we go in there and it's either me or Harris. Somebody's insane. We were both drunk, but somebody's a crazy person. I don't think it's me. There were some black people there. I don't remember, again, we're drunk. Nothing happened. Like Craig and we're like, hey, let me tell you some stories about the, no, I would no. know. I just said, but I, I felt kind of bad because I was like so drunk and I was so concentrating on drinking. I was like, here's some black people. I'm like, and I'm like, man, I kind of worry, hope they didn't think I was being antisocial or mean. I was just trying to, fo I was so, you when you're, you're drunk, Murphy. you're like, it's hard to focus and, and be productive. So I was like just trying to get that shit down and it didn't say anything to the people sitting next to me. So hours later, we're back at my place. And I'm sitting there trying to my hunt things, and I, and I bring that up. I'm like, oh, man, I hope I, as we're getting sober and I'm mm -hmm. remembering this more clearly, I'm like, I hope I didn't offend those black people. And she goes, there weren't any black people there. And I'm like, yeah, there were. There was like five, six black people, and then there's one, and then there was a couple over here, and then, like, because when they're kicking people out, it was like, you guys got to get, 
And then they came to us, and we were like, last. And she's like, there weren't any black... And I'm like, okay, like, I was drunk, but I wasn't delusional. So, and she's like, how racist are you? And I'm like, what? I mean, it's not racist. I just, there were black people there. You're crazy. And then we go to this thing where it's like, one of us is nuts. And I, it's not me. You sure? I, well, well, I've never met her, so, but I've known you for quite some time. <laughs> a long time. And I'm pretty, okay, I'm off, but I'm not like I've known you. I've known you longer than I've known my wife. Yeah. Is that true? In a couple months, but it still counts. Yeah. So, you, okay. But that's our that's the story time I wanted to tell. Racism. It was, yeah, it was racism, but it's fucking funny as hell. I'm like, oh, I'll have a blue moon. And she comes around the car, she's like, no. So, yeah. The funny it's, thing, you're both on the, you're on this mission to get this I one know. beer, and she's the one that has to remind you of the one beer. Oh, it was for the whole night. So it needs to be like a skit request for Murphy's. And as soon as we accomplish all the other shit that I've been talking about accomplishing for 20 years. You finally get we'll your Murphy's. Together, we'll probably, we'll, you know, the quest for Murphy's. We'll make it an hour and a half long film. God. It'll be like the road to Canterbury, where you meet a character and they tell a story, <laughs> and you meet, you meet somebody else in another bar and there's a love story to it and all this stuff. And then I fucking forget about it. <laughs> the whole point. And I'm like, oh, I'll take a blue moon. She's like, no. So yeah, that was that was the story. But he was kind of, and then we debated like he was kind of a dick. The guy who kicked us out, but it was at the same time. It was like, he's got to deal with people coming in every day and throwing down really shitty Irish accents. Mm -hmm. and so, yeah, that's <laughs> our story time. Thanks for watching, if you did at all. Uh, I'm Whitey, this is Cracker, this is Why White Guys Show. Like, subscribe, tell your friends, etc. And, ready? Good, Good journey. journey. Yeah.